seven and a half meters. A generous length for a model railway, some might say. But they'd be wrong. Even at a scale of 1 to 148, 7.5 meters is just over one scale a kilometer. A high speed train, traveling at its maximum speed of 200 kilometers per hour, will travel through this distance in just over 30 seconds, a tiny fraction of its journey time of nearly 1.5 hours from London to Bristol, or more for farther destinations such as Cardiff or Swansea. Representing even a tenth of the London to Bristol journey in model form in this scale would require a space of over 100 metres in length. So how can a substantial portion of mainline railway be represented without needing the sort of space available only in a disused warehouse or aircraft hangar? The answer lies here, in the computer used for controlling the layout. By using the computer to simulate track and trains beyond the boundaries of the physical model, a virtual extension can be created, allowing the model and computer together to simulate many tens of kilometers of railway, much more than can practically be achieved by model alone.